the first Boeing 747-8 freighter for Cargolux Airlines is now open for business. And the Luxembourg-based carrier is not wasting any time putting the brand new jumbo jet to work. Just hours after the final delivery documents were signed, ground crews were already preparing the first cargo load. We will be your ambassadors to show that you not only construct great planes, but that your customers can make money with these planes. That's what we will prove now. No better way to prove the 747-8 is revenue ready than using it on day one. Cargolex pilots flew the jetliner from Boeing's factory to their hub at Seattle Tacoma International Airport, where all kinds of cargo awaited. First up, a massive wooden crate. It goes through the nose door, no problem. Then another one the same size. Meanwhile, toward the back of the plane, crews start sending up a steady stream of pallets filled with electronic equipment, plants, and other items. It is economically, it's quite important to have a, a load on the first flight. Cargolux teams are used to the 747. They fly a fleet of 747-400s to destinations around the world, and there's not much they haven't carried on board. Everything from uh, cars to helicopters to aircraft engines to electronics to perishables. With the new 747-8, Cargolux and other airlines will be able to carry even more stuff. Stretched 18 feet or 5.5 meters longer than the Dash 400, this airplane can fly 22 more tons for a total of 147 tons of cargo. And thanks to a new advanced wing and next generation engines, the Dash 8 will do so using less fuel with fewer emissions. The new Dash 8 is a real game changer in the air cargo market and will replace our 400s as a reliable workhorse. This is the first of 13 747-8 freighters that Cargolux has on order. So its pilots will be repeating this routine quite often. Meanwhile, the first revenue flight is set to take off, one that will be followed by many, many more. It's going to go full speed in operation. Uh, for the first uh, five, six weeks, we do expect to fly this average of uh, 14 hours a day. 